Tire shops in the Port Angeles area say they have been flooded this week by several hundred drivers with one thing in common, screws lodged into their tires. And it all happened along Highway 101 here east of Port Angeles. Camera 7's Michael Spears reports the spike in flats has caught the attention of troopers. These screws came from one tire, causing a lot of problems for drivers in this area. Spoke with more than one shop. This actually had to stay open later to deal with all the people who have come in with these screws lodged in tires. An unexpected rush. It was like our snow rush without snow on the ground. Hundreds of drivers with flat tires. <laughs> all with these screws in their wheels. Close to 400 since Monday morning. Les Schwab manager Randy Schroeder said he's been in the business for more than two decades and has never seen anything like it. As many from one up to as many as 22 screws in a single tire. Les Schwab counted 22 drywall screws in this tire. We had about a dozen in the front. Brady Williams says he's had this pickup for two years and never had a flat until Monday. We saw was a plastic bag uh, in the road. It was raining and it was dark and felt a small bump bump and I thought well that bag wasn't empty and didn't really think anything of it. Brady and other drivers say the screws were picked up along Highway 101 in the Morse Creek curve area. Other shops like Discount Tires say they too have seen a spike in flat tires, averaging an additional 60 to 70 drivers a day since Monday and three and a half hour wait for fixes. Troopers tell us state crews have come out and used magnets to collect screws from this area. It could have very easily, you know, caused a blowout. Some tire shops are now fixing these flats for free. Troopers say they'd welcome any tips about screws intentionally being dumped, but right now all signs point to this being an accident. Customers are very frustrated because a flat tire is not something you plan on. A headache absolutely for the drivers, but luckily the Washington State Patrol says they have not had any crashes related to these screws that are stuck in tires. Reporting in Port Angeles, I'm Michael Spears, Cairo 7 News.